Every day, Emma was addicted to her phone, trawling around social media for hours on end. She couldn't leave the house without her phone, which had become a source of constant distraction and worry in her life. She met an older woman who was also waiting for her order while waiting for her coffee at a cafe one day. The old woman began to converse with Emma, and as they chatted, Emma saw how pleased and at ease the woman seemed with herself. She questioned the woman how she could be so tranquil and cheerful. And she was told, my dear, I live in the present moment. Emma was piqued, and the woman began to impart her knowledge. She encouraged Emma to put her phone down and pay attention to the world around her, to enjoy nature's beauty, and to relish every minute of life. Emma began to heed the elderly woman's counsel. And she began to put her phone aside more frequently, going on long walks and appreciating the world without distraction. Emma noted that as she became more present and conscious, she felt more serene and pleased than ever before. She was able to appreciate the little things in life, such as the feel of the sun on her skin, the sound of birds chirping, and children laughing. Emma learned the value of being present in the moment and enjoying life to the fullest from her experience with the wise elderly woman. She understood that her phone addiction was preventing her from fully enjoying life and resolved to make a change. Emma continued to frequent the cafe and converse with the elderly lady, gathering more knowledge and insights with each visit. Her life was richer, fuller, and more meaningful than it had ever been before. All because she had learned to be present in the moment and appreciate the beauty of life.